business at hand for the Bills. That was accomplished on their first play from scrimmage, when O.J. Simpson took a pass from Gary Morangi for 64 yards and the touchdown that broke the record set by Gail Sayers in 1965. At the tail end of a dismal, disappointing season, the Buc Larry Walton, 49, in at a wide receiver spot now. Munson going, and it is complete! Touchdown to Frank Lewis, the former Steeler, and the Bills have their first score of the season. You think he loves that, Jay? He gets traded from the Steelers to the Bills. He's running against his old partner, Mel Blunt, and Mr. Lewis gets even for the trade. Oh, I know how good he feels. What a remarkably fine throw from Munson. 84 in there. Munson throwing, and he's got the touchdown to Reuben Gant. Beat Jack Lambert on that play again. If Lambert could have chucked him two or three times, Jay, he wouldn't have gotten open. But he could only hit him once, and Gant slipped out. Munson hit him perfect. Well, it's been a big second half. I understand. Better left unpublished, probably. <laughs> Robinson. Touchdown. Mark Bramer has it. That's his second touchdown reception of the day. How about tell you what? They should have thrown a flag, too. John Anderson had a hold of Bramer from the line of scrimmage to the point where he caught the football. How in the world he ever got loose, I'll never know. I do believe Robinson is looking totally for Bramer all the way. And there was contact from the beginning of that play to the end of that play between 59 Anderson and 86 Bramer of the Bills. But they're on the board. Yard line. Byron Franklin has been a wide receiver for the Bills. Copeland in a lot of trouble. Wide open in the end zone is Cribs. Good play. Worked around until he found an opening. No, that's Jerry Butler. Now it's Cribs. They were standing right there together, and Cribs found the open spot. Taking end zone replay, he's in the shotgun. I don't think this was a design pattern, obviously, but Cribs being the heads-up ball player he is, evidently saw his quarterback was in trouble and went to the open area, ran to where they weren't. But the kid kept his poise, and it was a good throw. Got to be happy for him after costing one touchdown with a four. Hopefully, with some interesting numbers, had those two interceptions. You remember earlier when he threw deep, and the Raiders were waiting. First and ten, a pump fake, and into the end zone. Hunter's open. Touchdown, Buffalo. <laughs> 23 yards and a touchdown. Coakler to Tony Hunter. Well, well the Bills caught five wide receivers are in. Fourth and 16 for the Bills, who need this play. There's a throw, a man is open. It's touchdown, Buffalo. if that's the last play that Dawkins makes before the end of the year. Well, anyway, when the game started out, we, we talked about the fact that, that Denver's defense has really been dominant. The reason they've done as well as they have. Oh, look it's at that. Brookings. Brookings. Brookings, touchdown. Illinois, Mitch 
Mitchell Brookins. Cooper should be in the ball game a lot earlier, but it's a lot easier to play at this stage of the game than it has been most of the, uh, the entire ball game. And the chant goes up for the defense, and it is caught on a deflection for a score no, if the play stands up. No, flag drop. Incomplete. Flag. Incomplete, Charlie. He was, the ball was knocked loose. I think the flag is going to be on Langford, 44, because it was thrown from the back judge at the middle of the end zone. We're at defensive holding, number 44, Henry refused, touchdown. See, it was a deflection, I told you. Staler. I, I stand corrected. Okay. As we take another look. I was looking at the hit right, yeah. right here, and I didn't see the right back there. of the Ooh. end zone. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah. And Preston Denard, eight receptions, 74 yards, and a right touchdown. There. Preston Denard was talking to his third and goal from the four out of the shotgun. Dufek throwing Preston Denard, touchdown. With starter Joe Ferguson sitting this one out on the bench, number 19 Joe Dufik set out to make Ferguson stay on the sidelines a permanent one as he hooked up with number 87, Tony Hunter, for a first quarter score. The second year player out of Yale, Dufik is one Ivy Leaguer who utilizes his brawn as much as his brain. His strong-armed 64-yard touchdown play to Byron Franklin helped give Buffalo a 21-15 victory, its second win of the year. When the regular season ends, home is the only place the Bills and Colts are headed. Three wide receivers, Andre Reed, the rookie from Cootstown State, at the top of your screen. Ramson and Richardson at the bottom, and Ramson comes in motion. Aragamo flares at the bell. First down. Touchdown. threatening scoring position now first and 10 at the 19 down 17 to 7 Enzo yep. ground pick at 82 the second pick overall in the draft to pulled hamstring and is out for the day Fourth and three. Caught by Reed. And away. Touchdown, Buffalo. And there weren't any cheers here in Indianapolis for that. Chris Burkett, a wide receiver, is in to replace him. Cribs on the sideline for Buffalo. Greg Bell, the only setback behind Ferragamo. Third and four. Handoff, touchdown, Reed. And Vince Ferragamo is the reason that touchdown is scored. He read a safety blitz. Philadelphia had 10 men up on the line of scrimmage. They brought everybody on the play. Ferragamo read the blitz, immediately dumped the pass off to 100% health. If he is, in fact, injured, you know, he's taken a whale of a chance with his career because he has not responded well. Second and five from the five. Four seconds left. And the Bills will throw for it. Complete to Ramson for a touchdown. Well, I've seen some strange things happen with two seconds on the clock. But uh, they're going to get another chance at an onside kick. And the people... Eight for the Buffalo Bills. Bell again the lone setback. Mathis in the pass. End zone. with a 
with an 11-yard reception from Matheson, and the Bills are on the board. He beat Judson, the quarterback. Buffalo Bills get three wide receivers in the game, Butler, Reed, and Burkett. Cribs and Bell are the running backs. Matheson in the shotgun. Burkett in motion. Matheson chased out of the pocket. That's it flies. Butler. Strike, Matheson scrambles, hits Butler for the touchdown. Okay, 21 to 7. Now you can bet the PA man will not be announcing those scores while this game is going on. Flag is down, Matheson unloads. It is caught by Butler at the 20 yard line. Touchdown, Buffalo, but a flag is down. Wait just a moment. the Bills with two big, big plays thus far in this ball game. It's against the Steelers, I believe. Let's listen. Offside, number 92, defense, decline, touchdown. Ringo with the glasses on. 12 minutes to go with a 14-0 New England lead. Totten on second and seven. For the end zone, wide open, touchdown. A 13-yard scoring play as Thad McFadden gathers it in from Willie Totten for the first Buffalo score. Third down, Gilbert timing throw, Kenneth Davis, touchdown Buffalo. So Gilbert, after making a mistake, makes a perfect throw, and the Bills are right back in the game, down 9-6, to six, the extra point coming up. January. We kind of like it in that 10 degree area with with the chill factor maybe about minus 15 with the wind. Touchdown Steve Tasker. Steve Tasker goes into the end zone. A special teams pro bowler. Jim Kelly saluting that good work by Steve Tasker who hasn't he had that's his first reception this year or second. First for a touchdown. Both. No. Be overcommitted. They're going to be mad. They're going to be angry. They give up the big play. They're going to try and jump right at you and maybe overcommit. And maybe you can catch them. This is second and six with the ball stop, spotted. Travis Brown three for three passing in this drive for 59 yards. Standing in. There's a throw. Touchdown Buffalo. Over the middle he goes and hits Larry Centers. Larry Centers 78th catch of the year. Results in the fourth touchdown reception by Centers. This pro bowler delivers the goods and Dave Wanstead knows it's a long way from over. And that's right and that's the reason he's going to the Pro Bowl. He catches the football better than any running back in the history of the league. He's got more catches. Watch right here. Pulls it right in. It's this week. So a lot of permutations still out there but never, no question the Bills are in the thick of it in the AFC. Niners have to go to New England next week. You see what the Belichick's all about. Got beat Monday night in the last moments at Miami but he comes right back on the road. He the Jets 16 nothing and there is a throw and a strike and a touchdown. An absolute thing of beauty with the rookie Lee Evans on the payoff end again. Matthews hits him. And that was a sensational throw Boy, it was. by Shane Matthews. If Miami can stop him again down here by the goal line like they did last time Buffalo was down there. Huge momentum swing. Sam Aiken is the slot receiver. Holcomb to the end zone. Caught by Molds for a Buffalo touchdown. Working against the rookie. Travis Daniels beaten in the end zone. Three Buffalo possessions. Three Buffalo offense. Mental reps. A five receiver set on third and goal. Holcomb guns short of the goal line. Caught by Smith. Dives for the touchdown. Team. Double tight end set. Holcomb under some pressure. Connection made. Molds zigzags in for the touchdown. Holcomb. Molds. Touchdown. 
Another blown coverage in the secondary. You've got the New England Patriots defensive backs all sort of looking at one another. Eugene Wilson was in the middle. Dwayne Starks was another one. Second down and 10. Lee Evans in motion. Evans has been shut down tonight. Holcomb comes down to Joe Burns. The former Georgia Tech Yellow Jacket Burns is in for the touchdown. As they're heading into the playoffs. Ninth play of the drive and a second and goal. Moving pocket. Holcomb throws. Caught. Lee Evans. Touchdown, Buffalo. Evans likes going against Cincinnati. It's as simple as that. Had a big game last year. You have a better shot with a guy like Kelly Hope. 4.03 to go. First tack. First and 10 for the Bills at the Jets 22. Here's Holcomb to throw. Holcomb over the middle. Touchdown. Eric Molds holds it in. And the Bills close the gap. Well, there's a lot of needs on this football team, and I think a playmaking cornerback is going to be one of them. Second and goal. From the three. Here's Holcomb. Throws into traffic for the touchdown. Roscoe Parrish first NFL touchdown for the rookie out of Miami. To do because it really requires no reading of the defense or whatever. You're just taking three steps back there and launching. And everybody in Buffalo says Jewel does that pretty well. Third and eight, he's going to do it again. And he hits his man, Marquise Goodwin, for the touchdown. Well, normally when you take a shot and you come back, you come back with... Went for it on fourth down, didn't get it, and now he is in this situation where I think he has to go for it. Fourth and eight, the numbers this year and today on fourth down. Jackson remains. Again, they need the 14-yard line. Lewis, oh, he's got the tight end, Chandler. That is a Buffalo touchdown. Big time play. Rush didn't get home. They're getting a little winded. You know, they go very deep on this defensive line for Cincinnati. You might see a shift change if they get the opportunity. If I'm the Bills, go no huddle. Keep them on the field. First and ten. Blitz was on from Nelson. Oh, he's got the receiver. Goodwin. Touchdown. What a throw by the young man Thad Lewis as he reads the defense perfectly. We just talked about it. If you can't get home with four, and then you decide to heat it up, and that's exactly what Mike Zimmer did. He brings Reggie Nelson. It's crowd on third and two. Lewis going to throw for it. End zone. Touchdown, Stevie Johnson. Now that's something that Stevie Johnson could do very well, and that is catch a ball in traffic. And what a throw from Thad Lewis. Red zone offense, Buffalo second to last in the NFL in terms of touchdown percentage. Jacksonville is dead last. Second and seven. Lewis looking downfield. Lewis wide open. Touchdown, T.J. Graham. And the Bills cut into the New England lead. Here at Orchard Park, they travel well. As Peterman throws, touchdown, Nick O'Leary. Throw for the young quarterback. Bills have to be careful here. No timeouts. Peterman to the end zone. It's caught by Benjamin. Touchdown, 